and Jasmine. And Jasmine. And Jasmine. And Jasmine. And Jasmine. And Jasmine. Dear Jasmine. Dear Jasmine. I wonder if this love is everlasting. I promise not to treat you like your last. Hi, babes. Hi, boobas. Hi, darlings. Hi, guys, and welcome back to another video. You've already seen the title, you've seen the cover picture. I'm pretty sure you know what this video is about. I have been looking for a place for like a month now. The good news is, I already found a place. I found a place, I found a place, I found a place, I found a place. I did mention on my Instagram that I finally found a place. Guess what? I finally got a place. No more searching for places. When I tell you I have seen so many places, it's insane. The housing market here is, is, is crazy. It's crazy. I started with a particular budget and I ended up going above that budget. Initially, I wanted to find a place for 1800 or 1900 Stop. I'm joking. Unless I want to go and rent somebody's bedroom, that is probably what I would get with that amount of money. Them. I was looking for one bedroom plus then a bathroom, a kitchen, uh, and laundry. Those were the main things that I was looking for in the place. I found a couple of them for about 2200 2300 Initially, when I started looking, it's like every week they increase the price. Those places were now 2400 2500 2600 I had a bunch of agents, actually had four agents looking for places for me, showing me. So I went for viewings. I looked at a lot of places. I think in total, I looked at over 15 places not even joking the good thing about having an agent you're not paying for these agents okay they work for free because when you find a place and you finally get a place they get paid from the rents that you're paying so they're actually willing to help you find a place with these agents that i was working with they found the places viewed it if i like it i told them to make an offer for me the agents are basically doing the work they put together the documents and you send them what they need your credit score bank statement etc and then they forward it to the landlords and most of the owners also have agents so it's like agent to agent everybody has the reason why they might not give you the place so um i found a bunch of places and i made offers for them but majority of them i didn't get i'm showing you four places that i went to see i hope you guys enjoy it was actually fun looking at these places and trying to get a concept of what i am looking for in my head too i found a place and it's a lovely place it's, it's a new building so everything is new i can't wait to show you guys empty apartment Finding a place in Toronto is not easy. It's not as easy as I thought it would be. There was this one place that I was, so, it was perfect. It was perfect. The building was not nice. It was an old building. Every single thing that needed to be done was done and I didn't get a place. Oh my God, it was perfect. You're gonna see the place. I was so happy. You can see that I was so excited about this place. And it, oh, it, it bashed me into my neck. But the place that I've gotten to work, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if you want more. I don't know, like show you guys all the other places. Let me know if you want to see them or not. I'm talking too much. Enjoy guys, love you. stock floor plan this unit is new so at the front you have the coat closet and the bathroom on your right and then you have the washer and dryer and the den is right ahead of you and then you have the kitchen the living area which is a little small and then the bedroom as well and you have a long balcony so this unit was for 2300 it comes with one bedroom one den one bathroom and one parking it also comes with water and heating as well
it was really really nice it also came with amenities concierge a gym an indoor pool security and a party room i didn't end up getting this place we're just gonna move on to the next one This building is also very, very new. When you enter, you see a bathroom right ahead of you. There's a coat closet, a washer and dryer, a kitchen, a big, big living room, a small balcony, and an, it has two bedrooms. So there's one bedroom and there's another bedroom, the master bedroom, which has a bathroom. It's 2,400, two bedrooms, two baths, no parking, but it comes with heating. With the evil voodoo Got me coming back for more Even when I've been screwed Dolls full of pins Pierce my heart straight through I got issues in my head I like you in my bed But you keep me on red Oh Everything is like a test I better not text Or I'll come off desperate What if I lay down And I play dead And I stay dead Maybe you'll get Sick of being the monster Out of my head Under my bed Think you're something Always sorry, the conclusion. Even though I offer all of the solutions, I wish you loved me like I love you. It's stupid. When I'm alone with you, I never feel lucid. I wish I wasn't struck by Cupid. I wish when I first saw you, I knew this. When I'm with you, I feel so useless. I feel diluted. My heart's been wounded. Silhouettes of you are like a time. Never really noticed what you want. With you, I don't ever feel calm. I can feel the sweat inside my palm. Play with me like cats and a string. You don't understand the pain it brings. You don't ever want to give me wings. You don't ever want to set me free. But if I lay down and I play dead and I stay dead, maybe you'll get sick of being the monster out of my head, under my bed. Think you're something. I actually liked everything about this condo it looked nice there I think there were some previous tenants so a few things needed to be done like the floors and the paint but aside from that it was perfect it was on the 30th floor and I'm scared of height but it, I was still excited so I did put an offer for this place I actually got it but I wanted another place so I ended up not taking it but it came with amenities as well a concierge gym guest seats meeting room games room media room business parking and a party room which is a lot for amenities This building was also lovely and it was new but I'm gonna take you guys through the floor plan when you walk in the washer and dryer is on your left then you have the closet on your right the den as well is on your right there's a bathroom the kitchen the living area was tiny and the bedroom as well with a closet and then you have the exit to the street as well so you have two entrances this one was for 2250 one bed one den one bath one parking and it did come with heating and water as well
I'm looking back at it this place was actually lovely I loved the kitchen and everything it's just that the living area was small but even that I could have worked with it I did make an offer for it and didn't get it anyway but it came with amenities it came with a meeting room vistas parking barbecue permitted at the back and then it has a party room as well but I didn't get this unit so let's go to the next one This is the condo that I really, really wanted. And every time I think about it, I have a heart attack. It's huge, guys. It's a huge place. When you come in, the den is on your right. You have the bathroom. It has two bathrooms. You have a washer and dryer. Then you have the coat closet. You have the kitchen, the big, big living area, the bedroom. You have two closets and a bathroom. It was for $2,400. Uh, one bed, one den, two bathrooms, one parking. It came with heating and water. This this place this place was perfect and this is the place that i wanted so bad but i didn't end up getting it just just look at the place okay it's beautiful see what I'm talking about this condo was newly renovated so everything was new and it came with amenities as well the building is an old building but it does have a concierge a gym a guest sheets uh, vistas parking party room meeting room pet restriction and a parking garage I was in love with this place and I wanted this place bad it just sucks that I didn't get it so that was it guys those were the first four places that i checked out i am going to be posting more of the other places that i saw so let me know if you guys enjoy this content watch out for the empty apartment <laughs> 
if you're new to my channel and you enjoyed this video you've watched all the way to the end but you're debating you're debating if you should subscribe don't worry what are you waiting for what are you waiting for what are you waiting for sweetheart what are you waiting for are you hearing the voice <laughs> hit the subscribe button hit the subscribe button hit the subscribe button are you are you envisioning this talent you're hearing this blessing come your way and you're telling me you're not gonna subscribe you will go to hell if you're also not following me on my social media pages my instagram my twitter my TikTok, everything you need it's at the end of this video i'm gonna see you guys on another video i'm actually on my way to my new place so hopefully i can shoot the empty apartment tour today and have it uh, edited and ready for you guys to see so i will see you guys on the next video okay love you bye